Hi YouTubers, how's everyone today? Today is December 31st, New Year's Eve guys, and I'm making pig feet on the stove top. I can show you different ways to make pig feet, but I'm gonna show you how to make them. I didn't clean them before you guys, but I did use vinegar, salt, and lemon to scrub my feet down with. And these are the four pig feet that I'm cooking because I'm gonna have a prosperity dinner tomorrow for the new year. Hope you guys enjoy this video. It's gonna be quick, short, and delicious. All I have is onion powder, hot sauce. I'm using a little accent. I know a lot of you guys don't like that, but just for the pig feet. Some chicken seasoning and garlic powder and onion powder and paprika for the color. And I've cut up some onion here. But what I'm gonna do first, guys, is let those boil for about 15, 20 minutes, just in some water. Then I'm gonna wash and rinse that off, okay? So I'm gonna put those in some water right now. I'm not gonna season them. I'm gonna season them after I take and get the gluk off, is what my grandmother would say back in the day. So I'm gonna boil them, get that off, then I'll be right back. All right, for that 15 minute or 15, 20 minute boil, just put you some salt in the water and take your vinegar and pour you some in there once that comes to a boil you're going to put your pig feet in there let it boil for 15 20 minutes take it out i'm not going to even use the same pot i'm going to take and use this pot behind me and cook them but i'm going to let this come to a boil put those in and i'll be right back all right guys i'm back now this is what my Auntie Lily would say. These pig feet are not that bad. This has boiled for 15 minutes, and all we got is this around there. They call it the gluk. So I'm gonna take, rinse them off, and I'm gonna put them into this smaller pot, and I'll be right back so you guys can see me season them up. All right, guys, I washed them off really, really well here. Okay, we're just gonna put these back into our pot, they cooked with all the glue off. And what you want to do next is this. I have some bouillon chicken powder here. I'm just going to go in and put it into the pot. And then I'm going to go in with some hot sauce. You can use um, any kind of heat you want. Okay crushed red peppers, any of that. I'm going in with a little accent. Chicken seasoning, guys. Great source of tasty on there. Very tasty seasoning. Then I'm gonna go in with my onion powder. Got some garlic powder. And I like a lot of garlic powder. And paprika is gonna give it some color. Okay. So you got all of your seasonings onto your pig feet. Okay. All right, now you wanna go in with your water. And fill this baby up. I'm gonna put a little more water in here, guys. I'm gonna go in with my onion. If you choose to use celery and all that good stuff, your trinity, go right ahead. And then I'm going in with my vinegar. Okay, I'm gonna put this on a medium, low heat, low, medium heat. Let it cook for three hours until tender, okay? Let me get a little more water and I'll be right back, okay? Just make sure that the water feels over your pig feet. Okay, we're gonna let this cook, guys, and we'll be back. All right, we're back. You guys see the pig feet? Tender. 
and actually speak he are really ready but this is like we're just gonna take put that back water back in there that's my second time guys and when I come back I'm gonna let this go on for about another 20 minutes come back and finish up this video so that you guys can see the tender pork pig feet okay let's come back to those in about 20 minutes all right we're looking at that guys come into it these are what you call good old-fashioned sticky icky pig feet guys that's what you have here follow this recipe you'll get the good juice the tenderness, these are falling off the bone. Pig feet, guys. Very easy recipe. See, the meat is falling off. All right, guys, if you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, subscribe, and give me a comment. And push up that bell for me. Look at that. Don't that look delicious? All right, guys. Everyone have a happy New Year's. Voila! Bye-bye.